Oh yeah! Wow, we we in here. We yeah, in here. Okay. We doing it. <laughs> I can't even lie. I was, I was trying to get my my ducks in a row. <laughs> yeah, yeah. In order. <laughs> my man, don't man, don't put us in it. We live though. It's all good though. Yeah, we, we live. So soldier slim. <laughs> we live, gangsta. Oh, really? we live, gangsta. Mm -hmm. That's all. Slim. Yeah. So uh, <laughs> if y'all haven't noticed, things look a little bit different. Um, this is the genius mind of. Who came up with this idea? Was it collectively? We're gonna go with Jabari. Yeah, J J Black. Yeah, AJ yeah. Black, innovative Black. Yeah, by the way, he, he innovated in the mug on this right Listen. here. So, um, yeah, we we try to switch it up, man, and try to give y'all something different. We might switch it again, depending on we look back. You know, <laughs> and be like, what the hell? I like it. I feel, I'm comfortable. I haven't seen it, but I feel like it looks. Cool. Fam, I'm comfortable. Steve, too cool. I'm comfortable, <laughs> bro. I'm comfortable for real. I got I'm pillows and a sofa. Man. I am comfortable. I'm proud about nigga, really though, but you know, yeah. it's cool. Yeah, this was bro. the only way that I could get in one of these chairs. If y'all haven't looked oh, at previous the episodes, they the have the chairs. We introduced the podcast. I got the That's stool. Well, you know, I apologize. So, like, I ain't mean. I ain't realize how selfish. No, it's cool. But now this is comfortable. This is extremely. Comfortable, so I, I I understand why you wouldn't give it up. I get it. It is a comfortable chair. I remember one time I got it by mistake. Don't brag. No, Steve. <laughs> Steve. Um, I think he texted me or something like that, or he he, he sent something threatening, mm. and was like, "Yeah, so we, you just taking chairs now? Is that what's going on?" I didn't mean to be the bully, but yeah, I felt the way like that. I was yeah, like, you know. He did. He hit me with a text oh, message. My ass got a comfortable to that chair. You know what I'm saying? Like. <laughs> That shit was made for me. Well, now it's got a new ass in town. Uh, <laughs> mm. ah, and I'm digging that. it. Uh, <laughs> for sure. For sure. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, we had a bun going on. Y'all you know did saying? have a bun. Sometimes buns are meant to be broken over. Mm, listen, create new ones. Create new buns. I feel you. Build it up to break it down. Mm. Mm. We'll let it play another 44, day. 422. You know what's going okay. on. Shout out to Sanfa. Okay. I don't know who that is. That you you do something you out there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. In homage to Nas, you know he made a song called Build and Destroy. Peace. Shout out shout out to Nas. Shout bro. out to Nas. And shout out to Soldier yeah. Slim in the building. Yeah. Yeah, you de <laughs> you kind of him to spit some gangster <laughs> shit. You definitely got your 504 gear on today. <laughs> definitely. Do, do he, Go got ahead, he, oh, he got the G Nike. He got the G Nike on. He got oh, the G Nike. He got the G Nike. He got the G Nike. Yeah. He got the G That's the G no, night. No, them, them G nights. I thought the New Orleans thing was the, the white on white Reeboks. No, no, no. Boy, yeah, boy, yeah, yeah but yeah, but the that but that's but it. the Air Forces are affectionately known as G nights. G G what? G nights. Nike, like Nike. Yeah. Oh, okay. Nikes. Yeah, you in cold, bro. Like you could be down there straight from the seventeenth or something. When nobody even like. Just don't. Until speak. you open your until mouth. Until you open. That's what. Just don't no speak. Slug. Hilarious. <laughs> but I'm gonna tell you, the new generation kind of speaks like y'all. Like they they got they ain't got the floor they ain't got they the got floor. Up north lingo to them like mm. for sure like that's true if it wasn't for the Bronx that's uh, shit would be going on alley oop alley oop you bro, know we, Chris we, Paul to Blake Griffin I got you yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey uh welcome to the No Buffer Podcast yeah, yes we here we, yes. Here. we are here um I am last name good until my right you still to the right that's what still I'm talking to the about right, hey. how the lovely Cheyenne is, always bro. keep it here to the right mm -hmm. yeah and then to my right I got the handsome. Hey, you make me blush every time with that. Lego <laughs> Steve. <laughs> Y'all should have seen it. <laughs> I was like, oh no, what was that? <laughs> when you That's get that when you get that right cut, right for real. get that fresh cut laugh. Yeah. Now I should have seen him picking up this table. I was like, Yeah, oh no, Steve just I was like, oh, he's he so dead strong. Girl, you better stop. Oh my god. <laughs> Girl, you better stop. Oh my god. I just wow. Girl, stop. <laughs> what stronger. what else can you pick up? You got, you got, oh, okay. <laughs> we don't got these sofas. Y'all don't got feisty out here. Now, hold on, now. Shit, shit get rushy here. And hey, it's squirting everybody out the room. So y'all step out for a second. Some grown <laughs> man. It's grown. Right. Y'all crazy. Go ahead, pop that other bottle of Pop the bottle of Ducey. Do say. Pop the bottle of do say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, she, you a fool, boy. Where's that? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Don't scare me with a good time. <laughs> Bro, so um I, I wanna tell y'all about my weekend. Go ahead, that's all right. Go ahead. So my, my sounds like it's gonna be on the somber note, but go ahead. 
So my weekend started on, first off, Paid America had a show. Killed it. Shout out to Jackson, Mississippi. We did our thug this one. Y'all get y'all some seafood? We actually went to this spot called Stamp Burger. Y'all went to a burger spot where they got the seafood at? I, I didn't know anything about That was my first time ever in Jackson, Mississippi. But anybody by that Gulf got some good seafood. They got good you seafood. On that one. And then the thing is, like, we, we were sleep listening to Smoke because he used to go to school down there. What school? Jackson State. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah. He and so okay. he told us about the spot. The burger was good. It was a huge burger, though. It was like probably like something like, like that for like $10. Fries. Mm. Black owned establishment. So, you know, we, we, we did that. We did that. You know what I mean? Had spoke to an uh, OG down there, uh, old school, you know, them old time, they give you that game. He was like, look, he looked around. He talking to us like we from Jackson. He was like, I know y'all buying some property down here, right? Like straight up game. <laughs> yeah, he was, yeah I, I was like, he was like, oh, he was telling us the location to get it for and everything. I got a little bit, I recorded a little bit of it. He, he went, he went a little to the left. He, he went to talk about all kind of crazy stuff. But mm. yeah, I don't want to play that yet because we might use that, you know, how we try to. Yeah, use content for other stuff. Yeah. But my weekend started, I was going down 75, 75, 85, right there by Turner Field. And I got sideswiped in the Taurus. I was going to say, that was you? It wasn't you. You, you just got the Taurus. Oh, I was like, did you hit me and keep going? No. Oh, shit. Oh, no, no, no. It wasn't me. I don't the plot that. thickens. <laughs> no, oh, but shit. what I seen this weekend, I was like. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? No, no. So I got sideswiped. Oh, shit. Yeah, I got sideswiped by a, a, a Cherokee, black Cherokee. I was going to say, yeah, okay. No, wait, yeah, no. real talk. And, and so, you know how, like, you, anybody ever been in an accident, you get that first initial, like, whoa, I was just in an accident. Mm -hmm. So I'm trying to get my bearings together. I'm trying to pull over, do the right thing, pull over, let's go ahead and get this, this insurance information and all that, let's do the do. My man, I, as I go to pull over, my man mm -hmm. accelerates. <laughs> I was like, hold on. Oh, this is happening. Yeah. <laughs> this is happening right now. <laughs> I felt like a white guy. Life. I'm like, oh, oh my God. Sir. Like no, I no, felt like fell. a white guy. Like, oh my God, this is happening right now. Hey, I feel like you tried you because you were in the Taurus, though. Slick. Pull that thing, y'all started jumping. <laughs> <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like he tried right, you because right. of that, bro. Yeah. He probably said, this nigga whole dash little like Christmas tree. I know he ain't about to chase me like that type shit. Like, so I, 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 I started. Like, I feel like that's how I started, started chasing him. I, I started, and then I came to my senses. I was like, bro, we not about to have a pile up on. I did, we in rush out with traffic, and he like weaving through. Bro, I done been in the high speed chase, though, like, mm. for real. Like, Can we talk about that, or is it you don't want to incriminate yourself? What's up? Oh, hey. This sounds interesting. I look young. I was like, yo, where? <laughs> I was the driver. Like on some shit. Like, oh, okay. So we really incriminate ourselves. Go ahead. No, okay. I'm good. Go like, up, it's, King. <laughs> it's like it about five, six years ago. You know what I'm saying? So, Statue of Limitation 7. Go ahead. So I, uh. <laughs> you, you, right. I'm just, I'm just it giving is, you the information. It is. It is. Just, it is. I'm just letting you know, it bro. It is. Well, keep it real. Like. Uh, so Somebody you know. Nah, I was a driver. Fuck it, bro. I said what I said. I was a driver. So we, uh, me and my dog. I said what I said. Is it a no buffer podcast? Go so ahead. We were driving down New Orleans, me and my dog. You know what I'm saying? We going down there for the uh for the fourth or whatnot. So boom, I had took over driving. As soon as we get off the exit, my boy say, "Stop by the uh store so I can get a Rello." They stop by the store so I can get a Rello. Pulled up, bro. I pulled up like by the like finna pull up by the door. Mm -hmm. This white guy was coming off the pump. And hit our tail, like, knock that shit off, like, mm. for the most part. Like, it's dragging. So he up. hit y'all? Facts. Okay. Mm. Took off like a thundercat. Mm. My boy say, go. I said, all right. And, like, we running stop signs, red lights, all kinds Everything. of shit. I'm talking about, like, I cut him off. I got him. So my dog, he hop out. He going eight nuts. Like, you know what I'm saying? Man, what the fuck is you doing? Woo, woo, woo. Like, mm. you know what I'm saying? Dude, I'm, like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He got the kid in the back and shit on a high speed chase, bro. Like, oh, I'm talking about we really like Chasing. doing numbers down there in New Orleans, bro. What is he thinking about? Bro, he got the kid in the back. He was drunk. Oh, okay. that's even make it even that's worse. That's even worse. Yeah. Bro, yeah. I'm talking about like, and it's, it's so, he's saying, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He get to accelerate again. 
I said, bro, get back in the car. Get back in the car. <laughs> <laughs> he hopped back in the car. Hey, we got the door closed. I'm p- punching it again. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Cut him off again. And nigga said, dog, stop playing with me. Like, you know what I'm saying? He trying to, he uh, reached in or whatever. Bro, took off again. Like, and then so we took off for the third time. And he was like, man, stop, bro. He breathed the hardest shit. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> shit sound exhausted, nigga. <laughs> it, was, it was like. Exhilarated, really. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I'm talking about it, for him. <laughs> but it was dangerous as fuck. Like, this is not like my neighborhood and no shit like that. Like, and you know they got some weird streets in New Orleans. You know what I'm oh, saying? Oh yeah, yeah. You know they what I'm got, saying? Like the middle part. Mm-hmm. There was like kids and shit in the car. It was a child in the back, bro. A whole child. That dude had warrants, bro. It was a child. In the, he probably didn't have no insurance anyway. You yeah, know what I'm saying? sure. Like, no so insurance. Probably been arrested. That, that was my dog. Was thinking like, I mean, he said that after the fact, like. He doing all that, bro. He probably don't even got no insurance and then like. Now you still, now you, it's still the same situation for you. You still got to. And I could stick, I could get fucked up just for even doing all this. Yeah, 100%. at that point, yeah, for like, sure. I wouldn't even think about that either. Yeah. That nigga said, "Go." I was with it. Like, yeah, here we like, go. Here we nah, go. On top of it was also Grand Theft Auto shit. It's on. That's exactly what it sounded like to nah, be that honest. Shit was wild, bro. That shit was wild. Like, you know, that's crazy, saying? bro. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, his insurance took care of it, which you know. That's what we should have been on anyway. There was no right, need. Right, 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 right. Last week, that nigga was hot. Like, bro, go. He was, y'all were go. And I punched <laughs> it, bro. I told you, we make it all the way to the city, bro. Yeah. We make it all the way to the city, man. Like, it was crazy. Like, y'all living like um, like some soldiers for real. I was going to say, that's, like, that's was, not rock stars. That ain't rock star lifestyle. That's, that's but you might not. Oh, no, he might not make it, though. Right. Mm. <laughs> y'all were, okay. That was damaging. Y'all was. Mm-hmm. So, I mean. In a, in, I mean, that could be incriminating, reckless driving and shit, but. No, that, no, that, it ain't, didn't happen. Yeah, 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 you got to come get me. Yeah, yeah, y'all, y'all good. And I'm lying. I'm going to say I'm lying. Yeah. Now, if you would have said, like, you know what I'm saying, then my man pulled out that thing and he don't. Unless he playing the band. <laughs> okay, let's keep on. Let's go, Cheyenne. <laughs> I'm glad they didn't come to that. Okay, cool, because you had that look in your you face did, like, you I did. mean, I just omitted that part. <laughs> I'm glad it. I'm glad I they purposely come did not you know speak on that back. Yeah, I just omitted that part. Cause especially like when you be people, you know they hot heads, and it could have really went left. left. Mm-hmm. And I feel like that kid kind of stopped them from. It stopped him from going left because I know he had that toolie say, on. He him. did all that. You if see what I'm saying? He was in the car. He probably would have let. Your man had that, that toolie yeah, on him. He, he from New Orleans him. too. He would have. I know he had that toolie yeah. on him. <laughs> the funny part really was funny when he started chasing the car the second time. Yeah. And I, I was like, bro, get in the car. Like, I had to open the door for him on my side. And y'all were living life dangerous. Bro, it was dangerous, bro. Like, and they have fucked up streets in New Orleans, bro. Mm-hmm. It's, not, it's like they the got, worst thing. Here. They got different streets and they got fucked, fucked up, up streets. Street. Sometimes they have whole sinkholes <laughs> sometimes <laughs> in them streets, bro. You feel what I'm saying? Like, real talk, bro. Well, you have to ride the on the other side, side of the street because you like, I'm not. Like, it's no, like, you can't oh, creep over there. You remember like, how yeah, 14th yeah. Street used to be before they just paved it? I got you. No, you yeah. Can't yeah, creep over it that. was like that, but, like, worse. You can't <laughs> creep over that, bro. You, you do anything over 50 on some of the streets, boy. You ask for it. Oh, front end. What? have your shit done. <laughs> what? You need all new tires. What? Uh, you go. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, that was that, but. That's interesting, bro. I, I didn't. You, you, man, you got a, you got a story past, stuff. bro. <laughs> I mean, being just vulnerable, a, sharing just his a, life. That's just one story. Sharing his life. We like to hear this. Part and in, of a, Steve. in another city, in another and that, we ain't no telling what been going on on the west side. Right. Tell my he did story, shit this man, weekend. <laughs> hey, you know what? I was listening to a currency interview like a couple years ago because he was just talking about like hey, how he's not that person that had a guns and shit yeah, yeah. Like that, but. <laughs> what that is, I'm just trying to go to the basketball game, but you know his partners be on the bullshit. Yeah, I don't had too like too many experiences. I was like, bro, I wasn't even doing anything, but it could have. <laughs> it could have went down. It could have went down. It yeah. went down like for no for nothing, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because somebody else not thinking. I that. definitely definitely been in that before. Yeah, like one hundred percent. one time I was uh oh, Steve sharing that this couch. Mm, it, it's a therapy like, session. I was like, the was, couch is doing something to him. <laughs> She was kicked off and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was this one time I was in Oakland City. We was playing basketball or whatever. So this dude I knew from middle school, he was real cool with one of – we had mutual friend that was riding with me at the time. You know okay. what I'm saying? So we leaving. He was like, um, bro, uh, Don said you can drop him out down the street. You know, Oakland City, everything, like, boom, boom. You know what I'm saying? But I stopped by the store to get a Gatorade. In the meantime, they talking about some shit that went down – you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. earlier, like, you know, man, this fuck nigga tried me. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You know, yeah. All that, you know what I mean? 
So I'm not even studying that shit. I got my music. I'm going to get this Gatorade. I'm going home. Drop y'all off. Woo, woo, woo. Pull up to the gas station. I'll say, oh, there you go right there. Mm. <laughs> oh, they was talking about there. <laughs> nah, no. No. Oh. The, other, the others. I got you. I was like, oh, <laughs> that was part of their story. Okay. Yeah. Go right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Out the window with it. I said, oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Lord knows. I parked that car in front of my partner house. Well, yeah. like a street over from my partner house. Yeah. Like, like down the street. And I took the bus home, bro. I, said, I'm not <laughs> I feel you. I think you. I'm searching for my vehicle. Bro, y'all not, bro. Yeah. Y'all not. And left that shit there for like Knocking two days. My, door, my people like, what a car it? I was like, oh, I left it over there. Uh, such and such. I got to uh, yeah, go, go to the tire. Yeah. Or some shit I said. <laughs> <laughs> or some shit some I said. Some lie. Yeah, bro. Ran out of gas. Ain't feel like going to get it. I'm talking about spooked me, but it was funny because I heard currency with like a similar story. I'm like, that shit really do be real like that. Like, it's real. You don't even be doing nothing, bro. You be mind that, bro. I came to hoop. Go home. I'm just trying to hydrate myself <laughs> with this bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Like, And it could have went a whole nother way. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I just came to dance for y'all. That's it. <laughs> you know like, somebody could have got hit. Now you got some other shit. Right. Mm-hmm. We on cameras with this gas station. Right. You feel what I'm saying? Like, it could have just went left, bro. Like, <laughs> Absolutely. Man. Real quick, too. Chronicles it don't of the take West Side. Second. Chronicles of the West Side. I'm mm. telling you. Bro. You should write a book. Nah, I ain't got that much stories. Mm. Yeah. I got some stories, though. They hit, I, I got you. They no, hit home. No, but, you know what I'm saying? Like, nah. Not that many. 100%. <laughs> uh, no, for real, bro. Got a I whole mean, book of that. Like, you, can, you can get a book off if you want to, you, but your story's still been written. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Still got stuff to go through. Yeah, but, yeah, that, that was that. How was our weekend? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, damn, I want you to keep talking. What else happened, Stephen? How does that make you feel? <laughs> I do have my degree in psychology. Keep hey, going. She, I know. Like she I know. y'all. <laughs> Listen, I ain't gonna lie, bro. That shit spooked me, bro. I ain't gonna lie. To uh, you, bro. I, I, like you not prepared for that. It's just like how far shit, it happens so quick. How quickly shit goes left for no reason, mm-hmm. bro. Like okay, and so I, I, and like and now to this day, I have a rule. Like, if I don't know, you can't ride with me. Like one hundred percent. You feel what I'm saying? If I like, if I you know, oh, this is my partner. You're dropping. No, he got to walk, bro. <laughs> I had a, I had oh, a story. New. Right. I had a story. Not exactly like that but me and one of my partners like we've been friends for years and um it was one of them nights where i came home and we were hanging out went to the went like shoot pool at this one spot we didn't even have a whole lot to drink you know we probably had like we both bigger dudes so we probably had like three or four beers which is really nothing for us that's like we we good yeah we good. yeah yeah but <clears throat> it was 12 was pretty much watching us leave the spot get in the car Turn the block. We probably got about a half a mile down the street. Whoop, whoop. So we're pulling on. I'm like, all right, everything cool, bro. Like, I know you ain't going to blow a point. I, I, I've, I've been with you all night. You only had three beers, bro, and we just ate, ate food. Mm-hmm. We good. He was like, yeah, bro, but I got my pistol on me. I was like, oh, my God. <laughs> it's about to go down. <laughs> not, only, Done, not, only, son. not only did my boy have his pistol on him, but his pistol was like on the floor. He, he keep his pistol like on the little. What's the little? On the little side compartment. You know the little, the the door, little side compartment. Yeah. So it's like it's when visible. It, it's visible, basically. Yeah, for sure. So he get we getting pulled over. Not only is he trying to move the, the move the pistol from there. Now he's trying to put the pistol up under the seat with his foot the whole while while the police officer is approaching the car. That whole time I'm like, well, we're going to jail tonight. I'm thinking about, I just don't want us to get shot. You feel right, me? I'm, I'm right. like, I've accepted that we going to jail tonight. But to get shot is a whole nother That's thing. a whole nother deal. Right, you feel right, me? Right, right, So, like, my man, he slick with it. He don't put the pistol up under, up under the seat. Police ask him to get out of the car because he already know we just left a bar. So, he already assuming. That's all twisted. We, we twisted. Mm-hmm. So, my man get out of the car. He, do, he telling him to say the alphabet. He doing all kind of crazy stuff. My man, like. Turn to an official white boy super professional. Ace in the shit. A, B, C, Ace D, the D, E, F, G, H, A. You know how you run that M- L- M- O, P, L, M, N, O, P. You run that together. And you got to pause. You run it. Q, R, S, T, U, V. Nah, you get all that. You're you nuts. Say nah, all that. All yeah. the letters. He walking a straight line. He was like, oh, yeah, no problem. He was like, yeah, I had two beers over dinner. Like, you know, he, he giving them the whole spill or whatever. So, police was like, all right, well, y'all good. Just take it easy. I saw you swerve in the lane, which he didn't see us swerve in the lane. He saw us leave the bar. Mm-hmm. You know how they try to do. So, we hop in the car. Then, uh, 12 asked me, like, so, everything all right with you? 
I was like, yeah, I'm good. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm like, I'm keeping my head straight. Cause I ain't, I mean, I ain't say nothing. It ain't nothing for me to say. Like you checking on my man. I'm not about to add any other information to this, this situation. I'm chilling. I'm dog. chilling. I'm chilling. If anything go down, I know his mama number. I know how to go ahead and make everything situated. We'll be all right for the night. We get, he get in the car. We ride off. Soon we ride off. The pistol just slide out and, you know, hit the, um, what I was like, bro. What all black people say, look at God. Look at God. <laughs> look at God. I'm like, bro, put that in the glove compartment, bro. At least we got to have a little more barrier. I'm talking about it, it could have been over with that night. That's just like we. You, you slammed them brakes a little too hard. That's one. If you would exactly, exactly. It was like, man, but I got I got stories like that for days, bro. It was, Let's get out this summer shit. How was y'all weekend? <laughs> Shia, I told you how my weekend was, bro. Shia, how was your weekend? My weekend was beautiful. I had a really good weekend. What you oh, do? Here we go. Hey, all right. So for starters, <laughs> no. Nah. Um. So my carpenter came up. Man, chill out. All right, all right, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Now you ruined it. I don't want to talk no more. No, go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> oh, my, I ain't do you shit. Say beautiful. No, it was beautiful. Say beautiful? You Cause I had go a really in. good, I had a really good weekend. It was productive, and I had fun. So I went to MJQs, which was really fun. I haven't been there in a while. Um, so that was fun. You've been there in a minute. Yeah, it's been, been, been a, a minute since I've been there. They, they like some nights they throw that old school rap on. I be like, that's the vibe. Yeah. I be on sometimes. Yeah, yeah. I ain't been there in a minute. The only, the only thing I don't go in that rave room. Oh, the other room. That's yeah. what I call it. The other room. Yeah, the uh, yeah. Like they, they, I ain't gonna lie, the nigga that be DJing, he be having the songs though. On the rave room? Yes, cause it, it don't be all right. Well, it depend on what night you go. But the night that I went, he had like old school, like seventies, like digging the crate seventies. A word? Yeah. And all I, was, I be hearing over this. <laughs> no, that's why I said you. It depend on what night you go. <laughs> Saturday, Fridays and Saturdays is usually that kind of thing, <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> nah. <laughs> But no, he had some he had some nice old school joints like digging the crates. I had to like like, hey, what Yeah. <laughs> what your crates looking like? Like it was cool. Earth when the fire type shit or what we talking about? No, we talking like some old like Donnie Hathaway, like mm. Yeah, he had some shit going. It was it was actually decent. Hey Cheyenne, can I ask you a question? Mm -hmm. I know you're a serious Beyonce fan. Can I get an honest opinion mm -hmm. on her new record that she um I don't it's it's okay. Okay, cool. What's I the appreciate record? you. What, what's the before record? I let go. She, she, redid, she redid the before, before I let, I let go. go. Frankie like Beverly, Beverly Maze. I kind of like that song. I like it. No, it's not that I don't like I it. I love I mean, the Frankie Beverly Maze version. <laughs> <laughs> I don't oh, think, I, don't, I mean, no, I'm saying, honestly, no, I don't no, no. think, that's one of them records, like, you just. I just feel like because the record is such a go-to record anyway, spirit, you cannot you touch that. not like it. She didn't do bad. Frankie Beverly just, he's the original, song, yeah. I mean, but then she, she did the whole remix with it. Before, Before I let, let go, go. Dun, 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 dun. you know the cookout dun, dun, song. Dun, dun, oh no, no, that's the club song. That's the club one. Exactly yeah. About. So exactly. she redid it, but then she did the little dance part at the end, so that made it. I like that. Okay. I like that better. Than I don't think she did bad. I mean, I feel like she kind of had to do it to get to. It's the not dance bad. Part. I just feel like it wasn't needed. Some things just don't need to be touched. Yeah. yeah. That's how I feel about all Michael Jackson songs. That's why I hate cover bands that do Michael Jackson you know songs. People come with these sequels to the movies and some things just don't need sometimes to be touched, right? while they said it, it was best. gold in the first time sometimes mm. though the sequel example. sucks uh fast and the furious should have just left it at one really a uh, couple i was gonna say <laughs> i don't know i, I, I mean, would say a couple they on eight they on eight and and Damn. i just saw oh, um, yeah they are yeah yeah they yeah. did the eight that's the last one they did they doing a uh spin-off with the rock with it hard and what i saw but why see, that's the thing uh. that's the thing with money get it Tied up 100%. Like, because you look at the first one, the production ain't got nothing on what was on five to eight. Absolutely, absolutely. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, so when the money get involved, like, oh, we got a cash cow. You just they get, spending money in yeah, five to eight. Keep, yeah, you just keeping <laughs> up. Just to, you know. What but I'm that's saying? Like, like the Sopranos. They're bringing like a prequel to it, and I just oh, word. Yeah, I wouldn't mind that though. Really? That's like okay. I know we've been on the Game of Thrones tip. How I ain't seen that. Sopranos is one. I probably seen you probably like, maybe the first. Five episodes. I won't mind it was, that though. Yeah, I've only seen like maybe two or three episodes of Sopranos. And Sopranos and, and like, Gangsta shit, man. And I know it's good, but it just. I know it's good. I just. A lot of stuff came Sopranos on HBO back in the shit, day man. that I didn't have HBO. Yeah, so I was going to say, I didn't have it. HBO, so it was kind of a thing that I didn't watch. Y'all yeah, mentioned Boardwalk Empire? I heard that's good too. I haven't seen it. What's it called? Boardwalk Empire. You watch it. It's good. Uh -huh. I don't watch a lot of TV, so. That's some but shit too. It what? Got, it talk about it's basically about the uh what is it called prohibition with the, mm. the liquor oh, okay. the some JFK shit period can we say that 
Gotti in it. John Gotti in there talking about how he started. He did. <laughs> Stupid. Hey, you know, the kid is just come after you now. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Moving on, bro. Nah, but uh, <laughs> nah, the Sopranos, the, the Sopranos, though, you know what I'm saying? But but like but like like I say on uh, the the cinematography side of uh, yeah. the Fast and Furious, you know, kinda yeah, better of kind of impeccable, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Right, but right. When you start reaching and Big it really be the storyline. Start doing like, yeah. just, like superhero even, shit. Like yeah. these folks, regular people, bro, with muscles, bro. They not right. breaking through walls and shit. They not like, come on, bro. With this, and they know. they definitely be going through walls on. The nah, I'm telling you, bro. Semi-truck. You feel what I'm saying? Stopping like pulling planes down and shit. Right, like, right, come right. on with this Terminator shit, bro. Now like, you know this is like that's just how I feel. Five hundred foot cliff. You did not make that. You know what yeah. I'm saying? <laughs> like speaking of Terminator, did y'all see? Uh, on a Schwarzenegger? I, I did. Yo, that drop kick was he got hilarious. Drop kicked in the back. He was at like, like a basketball like game Saturday. or something. Yeah, wasn't yeah he? he was at like a bat, like a, some kind of charity. Bro, they Daniel but... Sunday niggas at the basketball game, <laughs> bro? bro? No, bro. Bro, like one. You got to see how, because it's almost like. Two feet. Oh, my God. He came in. It was he hilarious. In, um, he ran in at an angle. He came in. Kai, what, uh, what's, what's the man that on Mortal Kombat? Oh. Uh, nah, see, like, Ryu. Uh, nah, nah, Luke Kane. He came in with Luke the bicycle style, bro. Both feet in the no. back of the feet. No. Both feet. Both feet. But guess what, though? Terminator proved that he was real live Terminator. He didn't fall, bro. Bruh, he he was like, oh. Whoa. It's like, he was like. <laughs> What's going on? Yeah. He did not he fall, bro. They showed was the other like, angle. Uh, was that a net? <laughs> yeah. Basically. <laughs> they showed the other Basically. angle, bro. He, he was held, his, like, he stood his ground, yeah. bro. Like, what bro. was that about? I have no clue. Nobody knows. Literally no one. And then this nigga. I was like, the th- the shoot thrown that bush or something, bro. Like. It was over in Africa, wasn't it? Went over in Africa. Oh, yeah, sure. he did um yeah. some kind of charity. It was like a basketball charity <laughs> event he was doing, and that shit happened. Yeah, it was, Yo, it was wild. Texas Walker Ranger <laughs> niggas at the wild. basketball bro, game. Bro, to see how he remember, came in. They uh allegedly it wasn't J Cole, but remember they jumped to J Cole looking like nigga. Over oh yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know what's up with Oof. them. <laughs> Ali, boom, by it. Niggas, niggas. Down bad. Hey, niggas. <laughs> <laughs> niggas think they going over there to get the alley treat. <laughs> they oh. just drop kicking you yeah, on niggas. sight. <laughs> oh, man. niggas is betting twenty dollars. <laughs> hey, I bet you on drop kick this. Nigga. This is middle child shit. I can't get jiggy with this shit. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna drop kick the Terminator? <laughs> what? Oh, man. Yes. What is this KOD shit? I can't get jiggy with this shit. Oh man, you stupid. What is this <laughs> motherfucker? <laughs> Bro, they had to do my dog. Like, oh no, my they, I'm talking about drop. Also, it wasn't J. Cole, though. No, it wasn't J. Cole. I mean, I thought. Oh, no. Oh, I get you some I don't I know. Mean, they never confirmed. They never confirmed nor denied that. I couldn't see shit when I seen the video. I'm like, oh, oh. Like, no, it did look, stop. no, it did look like J. Cole for like a hot second. But, I mean, shit got I real, you know what I'm saying? Real, real like, quick. Damn. Niggas think they get love over there. Um, he ain't get no love. They got to have security, bro. Niggas trying to assassinate him. You stupid. With a straw. Nope. Imagine getting assassinated by a nigga with a straw. Nope. Nope. I hope y'all plan to go on tour over there. Nope. Uh oh. Hey, it's hey, a nigga man. in the window. Told That's legal. Hey, you doing all that, y'all? It's 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 all love, man. I fit the criteria and everything, bro. Good, bro. They gonna think you're American, but you come over there with that hell. You how to curl it, bro? And then you start talking. Oh yeah, on your ass. You can got, got you in the neck. Hey, <laughs> I get identified just going to the next state. Like, oh, you not from here? <laughs> Wait, do they ever tell you you look Ethiopian? Uh, you no. don't. You no. don't look black. Like y'all want to. Y'all want to know some real shit though. We would love to know some real shit. Okay, God, respect. God bless. So. <laughs> God bless. So like I did him a favor. So, <laughs> now he's gonna be more honest. He's gonna be more honest. <laughs> Oh yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. <laughs> so I like growing up. I got well. I'm gonna say since like tenth grade. That's yeah. why I started really growing my hair out because my daddy wasn't going for the yeah, yeah. anything hair. else except for fade. even all around type. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, he getting the even all around. I can even get the fade, bro. Just <laughs> even all around. Eyes. Even all around. Yeah, you speaking for with me? That one, man. my son. <laughs> <laughs> you know? I was like, with the eyes, because I don't care what he say. What he say. So, even all around. <laughs> so it it. it, it, it <laughs> <laughs> See, that was my mama. No, no, <sighs> off. So it like the till grade. You know, I had a job. You know what I'm saying. So that's when all all kind of stuff started. Stopping like, 
Yeah, I you know I gotta buy my own shoes, clothes, right, 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 right. Your haircut. You know what I mean? All that. You know what I mean? You so, a mini grown? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I, you know I went a few weeks without cutting my hair. I was like, oh, it kind of you know twisting up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Like <laughs> yeah. that way. <laughs> so, you know what I mean? What Girl. daddy say? And look, it's a little lower than it's this. Lower than it get it get the deep waves. You know what I mean? Like mm-hmm. oh, you know okay. what I'm saying a little roller coaster shit. Okay. Going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a little, you know. So. <laughs> So growing up, yeah. I told people like I got so tired of asking what I put in my hair because mm. I really don't put anything in my hair. I started telling people like my mama from Ethiopia, my daddy from Trinidad and Tobago. <laughs> wow, Yo, you was <laughs> you was <laughs> down to a T. I started playing with it like Yo, your line like, was oh, exquisite. I bet you all the females are falling for that. For sure, for real. So like oh, you had some bitch in her at home like yeah and he Ethiopian yeah cause he fucked on my mom but then even if you see my mama you know that shit go down to the roots like she ain't yeah. got weave and got me all that you know yeah. so no, no offense to anybody who wears weave it's chill beautiful out right now chill that's out. beautiful beautiful I see you queen but that like <laughs> <laughs> that was a little twenty two shot right. <laughs> put right. that little shit up right exactly <laughs> basically what he want to tell me is like yeah but no. <laughs> So boom. <laughs> so I just start playing with I start telling people all kind of stuff like, you know what I mean? Like just I was hearing that like every day. I'd be on the train. What you putting in your hair, fam? Nothing, bro. Like yeah. am I that black? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh yes. Yeah. But you know what I'm saying? Like I like I started just playing with it. Like, you know oh, that's what's up, bro. You uh, you can pull that over because you don't look like you know what I'm saying, like black like you, you don't look, look african-american you, you from somewhere else you, you yeah yeah you you know, do. god bless but uh <laughs> oh my god god it's definitely how i play with that you know what i'm saying it's but too, said it was ethiopia and, Tr- and trinidad and tobago yeah yeah. yeah. that was the first I mean, thing but, popped up either? but what made Thanks. you pick those i'm just curious I'm like, first thing you like yeah, that first thing first you gotta, you gotta be on your feet you know what i mean you gotta be witty out here like <laughs> <laughs> no actually man like <laughs> Nah, for real. Nah, but for real, my mom. What you putting I'm like, my mom, she from Ethiopia, my daddy from Trinidad and Tobago. Then you got to hit them with the. No, I hit the serious. No, you do. Yeah, yeah, that way they and know it's for like, real. They going for. Then you oh, go to the crib, like, damn, that, that sounds good. Oh, okay. <laughs> like, that's what that 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 You got somebody in high oh, okay. school looking at their yearbook, like, yeah, bitch. And then his mama was Ethiopian. <laughs> so what I. <laughs> his nigga is gorgeous. It was once you get into high school, I forgot I told her that. Yeah. And she mm. was running with it. I was like, nah, my, f- my mama from the west side, my daddy from Bacchettisville. Like, yeah. I'm sorry I told yeah. you that. Oh, you fucking like went off. Like, yeah. like <laughs> just went she off. Was like, plotting, bro. Yeah, she my was... shit still curling. No, bro. she was like, plotting on you. Like, she probably was telling out everybody, like, nah, hey, mama from Ethiopia. Like, so what you, what what you saying say. is, Steve, we asked somebody from your high school what the one thing they remember about Steve, they're going to be like, well, his mama. From uh, Ethiopia, his dad from Trinidad and Tobago. I still believe. Bro, you mm. got like some real. I, Cause like, I ain't called clean with everybody. You got some you know real twenty one seven shit going on right now. I, mean, I, love I, I haven't been out the country, but I got you. Okay. <laughs> I, I, good to one globe, Trida. Yes, I am. Yeah, yeah. There you go, bro. There you go. <laughs> Facts. No, bro. Look, like, you look like you was about to deny it, bro. I wasn't gonna deny you look it. Like you was about to deny it, dog. Because if I could be honest with you, right? So, like these past couple of weeks since since I've been back. Oh no! Okay, since you no back. no, I'm saying like how's the time change been for you? It was cool. I didn't really have a lot of jet lag. Mm. To be honest with you, look at but the, like, he's used to that. Look at the look, look at the flex. Yes, it was all right. Used to that. I'm trying to be serious. One day asleep. I'm really trying to be serious. Oh, all right. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> but no, like since I've been back though, for real, like people ask me, like you know, I tell like yeah yeah, um, me and my wife we went we went to Italy. What I was like, oh okay, weird flex, but okay, all this I was like. And then it got to the point where I was just like, no, honestly, like, bro, we just saved our bread. That really what happened. Because you see how he, he got real low when he said, me and my wife, you know, we went to Italy and whatnot. But, <laughs> bro, just talk your shit, man. You I'm blow trotting out here, bro. Next is uh, Bangkok. Like, that's what we got going on. I, said, I no. know it. Harry. I know Probably. It. Saint-Tropez? Mm, that's a good South one. South of France, Saint-Tropez. Get a tan. I'm already black. Rich, I'm already that. You don't know who I'm. You. Listen, I'm not. The first one I was about to say before, I'm not even going to answer. I don't like being insulted like that. Bro, okay, but it's I was disrespectful just then. Yeah, bro, like. No, bro, real talk, though. I'm tired of niggas, bro. Like, I got a partner like <laughs> that, too, tired. bro. No, I got a partner like that, <laughs> so too, somebody bro. Somebody recently has tried you like yeah, that, as well. Bro, like, who crowned you, bro? <laughs> who died of me, bro? 
He still didn't answer. I said I'm not hey. answering. I said that. No, I'm not no. Answering. Hey, uh, Steve, know, Steve Listen, know where those lyrics came nigga, from. My nigga gonna hit me with the, oh, I thought you said you didn't know who Gil Scott Heron was. Bro, who told you that? Like, you know what I'm saying? Who told you that, bro? Like, That's awful. who crowned you? Like, right. <laughs> every time he tried to put me on to somebody he think I don't who know. Who made you a historian you today? You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. like, what they got. Right. Of music <laughs> game, like, I feel like I've done this before, but I will go on record and say Steve has a wealth of, of knowledge when it comes to hip hop. An, an impressive wealth of knowledge, especially considering you know your age. I wouldn't expect for you to know some of the things that you know. I appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, that's real I, talk. It just certain things I don't like. People try like who crowned you, bro? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, yo, I, I you know I'm just not used to people like this is new for me, bro. This new territory, bro. I don't try you like that. Mm. Right. Stop playing with me. Bro. Get them. Yeah, like. Yeah, I know, can see how know, people could be off put you know, about it. Huh? I can see how people could be off put. Bro, don't assume shit about me though. That's no, true. It's true. I, I ain't hollering at you, Lil. Sorry. Who else I was like, hey, I, not me. I ain't hollering at you. <laughs> Get it. Okay, you know, okay. I respect you, brother. I'm just passionate. As a about black man, I, re I respect you. As a black man. As a black yeah, man. Bro, I'm just passionate hey, about that, bro. Speaking of uh, like speaking of black men, you just look uh, like Morehouse. <laughs> They commencement I forget, and I and I I wish I had the brother name down. Robert I Smith. Know. I don't Robert have Smith. it. Baby. Huh? Robert Smith. Robert Smith. Robert Smith. Shout out to Robert Smith. You up like forty sure. billion or something like that? Something. No, no, he's a billionaire. Yeah, he yeah. is a billionaire. He, I said up like forty billion. Forty billion. You said billion. Oh, I think he like the richest black dude, black person. Richest black man. Mm, that's what's okay. up. But he spoke at the Morehouse graduation, mm -hmm. and he ended his speech by telling them that I'm gonna pay off all hey, of all the graduate student loans. So do you know the stats on that? Three hundred and ninety-six graduates. Forty million dollars. Exactly, bro. Like, that is crazy. I, first of all, it's two things that stood out to me on that. Note. Go ahead. Mm. They only had four hundred graduates. Interesting. I'm like, damn. That's a. Like, I went to UGA's graduation not too long ago. Yeah, they got a whole stadium. Yeah. yeah. I mean, you know we did too. multiple times. Though. Like they had more than one yeah. graduation. Yeah, for Georgia sure. State too. We, we were deep too. Bro, they have a yeah. four hundred four hundred graduates. Like that's. Mm -hmm. Kind of wild to me, like a little bit. I mean, it is no, a private it is school. Wild. Yeah, it is I, a private school. A lot of these schools private. Yeah, that's not an excuse. But when I saw that number, though, forty million, and and for me, it t it touched me because I was like, that's supposed to be like, uh, uh you know, place of higher learning, like one of those mm -hmm. real institutions, like right, prestigious. Right, right. prestigious. Yeah, okay. that's the word. Look at yeah, yeah, that teamwork make the dream work. Uh huh. That was it. I got you. But, <laughs> yeah, that 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 and the. Forty million off four hundred students, like damn, like it's, uh, I did the math. It's like one hundred and one thousand dollars per student. So that's what I'm saying. It's, it's that's why he won't pay it off. Like that ain't all right. Go ahead. It's college a scam. One hundred percent. I think so. I think so. 100%. Unless unless you're going for specific uh, fields like science, technology, engineer, mathematics. So Anything. basically, that's you trying to build rockets or cure cancer or some shit like that, huh? Pretty much. Unless Anything. you want to be, yeah, yeah, no, real seriously. Talk. And that. I always say, lawyer. unless you're trying to be a surgeon or a lawyer, there's really no need for you to go. I ain't gonna lie, lawyers make my skin crawl. But uh, black, you think uh, college is a scam? Yeah. yeah. On the money side, but as a per, like it helps you as a person. Right. It help. I learned more with well, my undergrad anyway. I learned more about myself as a person. But, it's like I grew up in right. my undergrad, but in my master's degree, I I learned shit in that like. You got, a you got your master? Hmm, I ain't black. Hey, we're flexed, black but okay. No, that's, right? that's, that's, that's a good flex, okay. bro. Hey, no. bro. Nah, nah. I feel like I'm proud uh, of you, bro. Real talk. Nah, I'm proud of you. Congrats. Give it that black. But no, nah, I but definitely. I feel black. like you don't have to go to college, but it's 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 a good experience because you meet people, the network. Right. And you you, you learn different, so different much about yourself. One hundred percent. Different walks of life. Yeah. You, you know, learn a lot. Coming from the inner city, you you only see one type of person. Right, right, mm -hmm. right, right, right. So I get to college and see, oh, it's black people that got some money. It's right. black, you know, not even just you no know, white people, even just different type of black people. Right. I learned that when I went to Grady, which is like half white, half black, but it's yeah. in a decent yeah. area. But that's a good yeah. high school, yeah, too. Yeah, it is a good high school. That ain't yeah. a typical Atlanta high, like, public high school. I, like, I seen a Bentley it's in the in middle. The park a lot. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. see, the, like the program I was in it was called the Young Scholars. So basically, the requirements was that you had to basically go to a, a public school, mm. and basically the people that was in it was from the inner city, and you know they paid for our undergrad, our whole undergrad, and all that. Oh, that's dope. That's so basically, dope. the people that was in that program, we weren't experiencing stuff like that. I mean, I, I did when I got to high school, but you know, coming up in the inner city, like you right. ain't experiencing going to these big schools with you seeing Bentleys and shit. So. It's different. Right, right. 
Yeah. I'm going to speak on that Bentley. Was one of my dog, his uncle was uh, blocked. So, you know. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, there you go. There but it was like <laughs> other fancy cars out there. I got you. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? But the one thing, though, like what you said about. Um, I want to make it seem like that was the norm. But go ahead. Yeah, like college being a scam, bro. Like $101,000 per student. College is the new credit card scam, bro. Like, the it really is. And it's the new credit card. No, I'm saying you think it's new, though? Yeah, I mean, for our generation. Okay, like, okay. Your parents got in credit card debt because that was new. That's like, true. Your yeah, grandma okay, you're right. ate off the land. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. grandma had a philosophy of, like, if we can't pay cash for it, we can't afford it, we just ain't going to get it. Mom true. and them got credit cards and said, oh, we're going to spend it. We're right. going to get it. right. Then they told us to go to college yeah, that's true. and figure out how to pay for it. And so now we took out student loans. I mean, think kind of like, I don't want to say your age group. No, like, it's cool. I, I'm not even it's shooting cool. today. But, uh, <laughs> Thank you for putting that out there, but clean air. <laughs> around the time when you was in college or whatever, like you had unlimited, you know what I'm saying, on the credit card for the most part. They start doing that. You they, know what I'm like they, you get a, I know some niggas there like, 10, 20,000, like, you just run wild oh, yeah. with it. You know what I'm saying? Bruh, I, I tell people this. I, I never forget. It was, I was in. I my, limited. No, real talk. Yeah. I was at my yeah. grandma's house, and I never forget. I had three credit cards. One had, like, $5,000 limit. One had 3000 One had $8,000. In my mind, I was like, I got $16,000. I'm flexing. Not knowing that that's, like, if I charge them up. You got to pay it back. got to pay it back. You feel me? But, like, the one thing that I hated about that, looking back on it, Probably the first the first week of college, they had people on campus signing you up for credit cards for free pizza or a T-shirt. And we were signing up getting credit cards first week of college, not knowing any better because, you know, we haven't been taught anything about it. But now I'm in college. I had a scholarship, but I lost my scholarship. You know, I lost Hope Scholarship. So now I'm in college. I'm getting a student loan, and I got a credit card because I wanted, a, mm-hmm. I wanted a T-shirt that said it's college like on it. You feel me? <laughs> right. Like, it made absolutely no sense at all, bro, and like that. But now, like you said, $101,000 is graduating. And hey, most uh, people ain't paying that off no time soon, bro. No time soon. Cause you barely paying off 10 Business or degrees or yeah. socials, whatever, like Anything. science or some yeah. shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, but Even I mean, if, and that's why I say, like, if you if you connect the right way, like because mm-hmm. you might go there and connect with the right person, like it, it right. could be a scam, but it's like a 50-50 thing. But it's I like, tell you, like lottery, you feel me? I tell anybody, it's like joining the military. If you make the right connections with the people, you you, know you can maneuver your way up where you'll get the right job and you'll make. I agree. Do all I, that. That shit. was my whole reason for not joining a fraternity. I'm like, yeah, that I just too. really got to put that myself too. out there for real. Right. If it's just about the network. Same thing. I, um, I disagree about the military <laughs> just because I know people that don't went that route. The military also don't disclose everything when it True. comes to like most people. They they mentality is like I want to go. So I can have money for um for college and all of this. Right. But what you find out when you get there, you come out better really just going to the military and doing your I think it's like four. No, you come out better going to the military doing your twenty, retire, uh, get that check from the military, and then go and do whatever else you want to do. And the training that you learned while you were there, mm-hmm. take that with you once you get out. Because most people they go there for that four years, I think it's called the GA bill. Mm-hmm. They end up not really using the money the correct way for college. And you find out it ain't a seamless um, process of going and getting the bread. It don't mm-hmm. work like that. It's, no, it's, you got to do your time. And you got yeah. It's no, a lot I'm, of red tape I'm with. saying as far as getting the experience and get, making those connections, yeah. like that's what I'm relating it to. Like nobody tells you in college you got to pick the right fucking degree. Right, right. They don't right. tell you you got to you know do this is that and the third in order to get the job that you want and. So relaying those like the net just basically just networking like yeah. talking to people and you know making those test scores because you you still take tests when you in the military, um, you know of course depending on your MOS but you know my brother he's pretty fucking good. slight brag but you know just yeah, making MOS those connections. MOS mean everything too though because people be going in there be trying to like just do whatever score horribly on the what is the ASVAB yeah the ASVAB like and you be basically a foot yeah soldier. now you a cook. <laughs> You're talking cook. about I'm trying to like nah, fam, this is not how this works. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah that, that's why you mess up. That's why a lot of people mess up. Yeah, at, they like, don't score well on the yeah. test. Same thing. Same thing when you do when you go to college and you take those uh the entries the entry I forgot what they are now but yeah, yeah. those tests like 
Now you got to take remedial math and English because you just was bullshit on the Saturday because you wanted to go out right. instead ACT? of. And the ACT? No, I know. No, it's, it's like it's, a placement. Yeah, test. it's a placement uh, test that you take right before you get in. Yeah, like it's just a matter of taking your time, understanding what you're doing is, you know, do what you can today so you can fuck around and play tomorrow. Right. What Thanks. you you were saying something, Steve? You were trying to say something. I wasn't. Oh, I thought you I'm you was like you try to get some. I was, but I'm good. Like I forgot what I. Oh. Uh, <laughs> maybe explain it, bro. I'm good. Pulling a me moment. I'm good. <laughs> that's definitely a me oh, moment. Oh, good love and joy. Right. That's a life. <laughs> but yeah, no, that's uh oh, we coming back. I'm ready. I just I got distracted. Uh, snowfall coming back. So, I have to watch Franklin. Snowfall. What season? I got to catch up. This season, season three. three. I have to watch. So snowfall. look, I'm caught up with the shy. Oh, I'm not caught I up. Catch up. I got to catch up. I ain't watched today. I ain't watched today's. I mean yesterday's episode. Okay. That's that's the last one. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's, it's, it's deep. Okay. That's some great writing on that show. They are doing some great writing. I some thought they were going to force it a little bit. Cause I it's season finale? No, no. Oh, it's oh. two more episodes, oh, I think, for the season. It's only eight episodes for the season. Is it better than the Game of Thrones writing? Uh, better than season? what? Yeah. <laughs> is it better than the Game of Thrones writing for yeah, this from season? Clear, for what this I read season. on Facebook, <laughs> everything is better than Clear Game Cut. Game like, <laughs> for this <laughs> season, it is. Okay. It's just trash, right? But, uh... I ain't want to try to force it because I don't seen this script before with yeah. the Game of Thrones, but uh, um, <laughs> <laughs> salty. <laughs> but it is it is great writing because I, I mean I seen how it was setting up mm-hmm. two two three episodes ago, you know? Yeah, what I'm yeah, yeah. Like, I see where they was going with it, so I I ain't want to force. It. I'm, I'm you know quite interested to see how this last episode. Now, what goes season down. is the Shion right now? It's the two. second. Oh, second I got season. time. You got time, and it's only eight episodes. They're an hour piece. Like you really can. I feel like any time somebody says weekend. that, I'm just like, look, if I can catch up on Grey's Anatomy, for 15 seasons, uh, like 20 seasons. Per 15 episode, seasons? Yes. Like, what? Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm good. Like I thought the wire. I thought the wire huh? had some. Take you to catch up. Hmm. I was pretty diligent with it, so maybe 15 a, seasons. Maybe like a month. You've watched in a 15 few weeks. Se- how many ep- I mean, how, how long were the episodes? Because they're like 22 <laughs> minute episodes, all right? No, it was about 30, 45. That show, that show come on an hour? Mm-hmm. Oh, so that's probably 44 minute episodes. 44 minute episodes. Can we do the math mm-hmm. on that? Right. How many, <laughs> how, many, how many episodes in a season? It's about... Give me one second. We either know about the podcast. Can know. we do the Same math on that? No, a real talk, though, like... Would you do prep? No, I was at work. <laughs> I would be at work. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Oh, yeah. oh, oh slightly, but... No, <laughs> look, slightly, but yeah. <laughs> in the dark. In the and dark. look, got the black curtains in the house. I mean, the thing is, like, Grey's Anatomy is a show, pizza. like, you got to, like, you got to pay You're attention. Ri- yeah. It ain't no action. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, some shows, you can get caught up in the action of it. That shit start watching you. Like, yeah, yeah, Grey's, Grey's Anatomy. Anatomy. You gotta, you that shit start watching you. You got to get in there. hold on one second. I don't want to tell you. Yeah, that's deep. You watch this by yourself? Mm-hmm. On, so season he, he dig he dig yeah, yeah. I watched it by, yes I watched it Black Black so season one Set only had scene. nine episodes every other season after that has at least fifteen to eighteen oh, episodes it was deep it wasn't even no mm-hmm. short one mm-hmm. so and we're going in what's fifteen times an hour an hour it's fifteen times sixty minutes that's that's fifteen hours no matter how you want to put it so the so season <laughs> let's be clear so season fourteen had twenty four episodes Black thank you too oh, hard and what season fourteen. Had 24 episodes. That shit just sounds weird. That's season 14. And, and it was, I'm going to tell you how long it was. Wow. So, and you watched all of that? I watched the, the, the sad thing is, 15 times. So, I was at my best friend's house. She made dinner and we was like cooking and working on like an event we wanted to put on. So, this was, I started at like season eight. 228 hours. Yeah. In a month. And it's 42, it's 42 minutes an episode. Hold on. It's, How okay. many hours in a month? I just about, that's my point. I was like, somebody remember 228, 228, 24. I mean, KD, oh, I was like, who got a 30, diplomat tattoo? You're going to say 30. 720 with 30 days. Very accurate. Hours in a month. Very accurate. It's 720 hours in a month? I'd even give it a month and a half. Minus two. I watched it in the car. Hold on, say, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> it's 720 <laughs> hours that's in a month. Days. I watched 24 it times 30 days. I watched it all. I started mid season. I went ah. back and watched. That season, and then finish watching the rest. Okay, so, hold on, hold on. Hold on, 720 minus how many hours is it? It's 492. That's left. That's what she got left. So let's say you sleep, what, seven hours a day. Seven times, th- times 30. That's 210. That's 210. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you had about twenty hour, 200 hours of what? Free time. Mm-hmm. 
And then not to mention out of seven hundred. <laughs> I worked. <laughs> and I worked. we talking about I forgot about a job. That's what eight she hours. But no, but this is me at work. Yeah, I was watching it at work. Yeah. Too. So yeah, yeah you kind of okay. Yeah, I was that's, watching it at that, work. You probably spent a lot of time watching it at work. What yeah, I, was, no, that's was, all I did at work. Working at. Um, so I was working in property management at the time. Oh, she ain't doing that. I wasn't doing shit. I, I don't met them property managers before. They just be chilling until it's time for um. Basically, that's a lot of time. <laughs> that's a lot of time, that's a lot of time, time. Dog. Yeah, that's a lot of time. I'm trying to think what have <laughs> I watched that kind of caught me? Like probably The Wire, because I can sit down and watch like a I season of The Wire without even blinking and be like, hold on. I had an overnight job. I worked from three forty-five to three o'clock. I get off and watch three hours every day. Yeah, until I finish the shit. I can only watch an episode. I've been watching. I'm still on Breaking Bad. You tripping? Really? Since January, I've been on Breaking Bad. Like I'm in the fifth. See, I'm in the last sheet. I got like five episodes. Oh, it gets, it gets, it gets oh, it gets good. It gets it's good. good. Oh, it's it's good. Yeah. It's, that's a good. That's one of the greatest yeah. greatest things ever on TV. My time was more, a little bit more structured and like I knew what I was doing. Like yeah, yeah. that's yeah. the reason why I was able to. You see what I'm saying? But even when it, like I used to work overnight too. I can only watch two episodes max of anything. You seen like, The Wire? Yeah. But I just can't sit still that long. Like, so that's period. That's Academy. I mean, you know. You feel me? Like, like I'm going to go see the end game. Like, I don't know if it's going to make it. For three hours. Three hours. It's a long movie. And the here's the thing, right? This is, this is not a spoiler. But I will tell you this because I don't want it to mess up your perception of the movie. Just know that they're giving you backstory at the beginning. That's cool because I ain't really the biggest Marvel type person. End game. Because, like, real talk, when I was watching it, bro, like, I watched it at my folks' crib. It was a snooze fest for about a good, uh, you know what I mean? I was like, bro, what's going on? Oh, you was on the fire stick? Yeah, yeah. But you a Marvel person, so you already knew, you already knew I, I was I mean, I knew, I knew what was going on, but I'm saying, even watching the movie, I'm like, bro, what the action at? Uh, but they giving you, they, they laying the foundation for the rest of the movie, though. You know what I'm saying? John Wick 3, if y'all haven't seen that's a good movie, too. Y'all should go check it out. I like the John Wick. Action. Like from start to, to finish. finish, and you don't yeah, have like to. You don't have to be in tune, be up to date. I would suggest you, but you don't have to. Like you can watch it and still kind of figure out, like in the movie, like okay, this out because they give you a brief, like mm -hmm. okay, this is how he's yeah. at this point now, and then the movie ends. They definitely making a part four. I'm I'll tell you call that. Call Audible for the more. I like all the John Wick. Yeah, they good. Those it's action packed though. Yeah, it's a little bit like I love action. It's kind of like action to the point where like you like action and gore. It's it's all that. Kill Bill shit. Mm -hmm. It ain't born, kill Billish, but y'all fuck with the Born series. Do I? Jason Bourne, all that. One hundred percent. You know the last that one, one that I seen when they switch it up. Yeah, yeah. That was, that was true. The last one that I seen, I I don't think I followed it too great, so I'm gonna have to go back and watch the beginning and then kind of yeah. catch up again. Yeah. So I want to get on this Game of Thrones shit, bro. And we don't have I know, to, it, not, no, bro. I, I, I won't talk feel, about this for the rest of my soul. life, bro. <laughs> it's piercing your soul. Go ahead. That was the season finale. He threw right? the I mean, hand up like, I don't even want to do this. This was the series. No, this was, was the this was the season series, finale, right? Series finale. Series, series finale. finale. It's over okay, with. Yeah, it's, it's over. Done. Over. Yeah. It's done. And now they, I heard it's for to come out with a couple prequels. Yeah. I mean, but the same characters won't be in there. It'd be set like a thousand years before and shit. Oh, okay, okay. One of them. I can't get over the fact of how rushed it it was, bro. Like, is this an accurate description of what this looks like, of what the seasons were? I don't think I'm following the. Uh, it's a drawing. I don't think I'm following the the, the meme. Yeah. So it's a drawing that gets that's great and then gets oh, very oh, worse oh, all oh, the time. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, I'm with you. I'm with you. No. Season seven, one through seven was immaculate. You know what I'm so saying? It was, a, it was literally just, just the last one. one. Yeah, just the last I was one. One through this. seven. I got you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow. One through seven was immaculate, though. You know yeah. what I mean? So it really was just eight with the photo. Eight for with that the bullshit. Photo, yeah, the gotcha. It was just the eight. Figure. Okay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it was a stick well, figure. Look, was, even, even the last end of six looks decent. Like, they got color in there and everything. Yeah, yeah. yeah, <laughs> yeah. I saw a picture of, like, okay, so the Starbucks thing, that's a real thing, right? Yeah, but I don't know about the rest of that, bro. I the feel like this. I, I feel I saw, like this troll. Yeah, that one. I feel like they're just trolling now. You like? You think they did that on purpose? Like, not even the Game of Thrones people. I don't think it was there. Like, oh, you, oh think you think they somebody, somebody photoshopped yeah, it in? Yeah, like, I don't think it was. But there, the Starbucks, you saw that with your own two eyes. Yeah. So explain that for me because, like, I just heard like they said it was Starbucks in it, but they ain't really do the research. Hey, you know, keep it true. 
I, I wasn't even looking at that. I, I mean, you kind of see it, but you know, they had a feast, bro. I'm thinking it's like a one of the mugs or something. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know what I mean? Like whatever. Like I wasn't even looking at that. You know what I'm saying? But anywho. <laughs> he devastated y'all. I am say. devastated, bro. I am devastated. Cause think about it if I was the person who was catching it like every Sunday throughout the years. Right, right, right. I spent ten years invested in something and they ended that way. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like they rushed it like shit that was going down. It's it's going it like they make like war doesn't happen overnight, bro. Right, 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 right. Would you rather them do like longer, I guess this this season just in particular do longer episodes or it should have kept more it. episodes how many episodes how were, was. was was it per season 10 and this one was six and they, oh, yeah, they, they extended it a sure. little bit but not really not like, too much okay you know what i'm saying that's a god bless so uh <laughs> so, but but the right like things are like okay this lady she burnt down the whole castle and everything with the dragons one person yeah, what's her name the ari uh daenerys targaryen mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. that person with a, <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. with a with a dragon uh drogon mm -hmm. mm. yeah burnt the whole city bro like whole not city. Her, she normally don't kill people oh castle she don't kill people but you know not not it just wasn't this gruesome. Like okay. she was killing children and women and all kinds. She burnt the city, bro. Let me ask you this. If I was somebody who wasn't invested in Game of Thrones and I just came in and watched the last season, would I enjoy it? Yeah. Okay. Okay. But if I was Because you don't know the backstory. I was going to say, but if I went back and watched from season one, would I be disappointed? Yeah. Because <laughs> <laughs> you know the backstory. Right. All right. Because right. right. like, I'm telling you, the visuals is immaculate, bro, on each yeah. episode. Like, but. What you expect with ten million per episode? Like, exactly. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right, 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 That's right. a lot, bro. Shit. Ten million per. Mm -hmm. Anywho, it's a lot. Shot it burnt the city, bro. But it kind of fast forward like three scenes later, like everything's back well, bro. You don't build mm. a city back in. You feel what I'm saying? Three like, oh, I see oh, what yeah. you're saying. So they rush the timeline like, the time and time everything. Yeah, yeah. yeah, like from the last episode, she burnt the city. The now, beginning of this episode, cool. she, you know, she giving her Hitler speech. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right <laughs> got her armies and stuff. <laughs> got her right. armies and stuff lined up. She giving her Hitler speech. You know what I'm saying? It's still in ashes. It looked mm -hmm. like it's snowing. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, but now, like, 10 scenes, ten scenes later, like, it's back normal and shit. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Like, what are we doing? Just rushed. Yeah, right. like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's a new day. It's like, been. Uh, you know, then you go back to the, the books or whatever. Like, I ain't read the books, but I've been on my nerd shit. Like, yeah. go to the Cliff Notes. Do the Notes, Spark Notes, all that. Yeah, mm -hmm. shout out to Not them. really, but yeah, they ain't with a call, but yeah. You know what I mean? They got sites for these, though. You know what I'm saying? Oh, they got Game of Thrones yeah. sites for this yeah. specifically. Yeah. Okay, yeah. My bad. Yeah, people right. invested, bro. No, I don't believe you. <laughs> but <laughs> even like some of her ancestors, bro, they built that city in like a, a matter of like 10 to 20 years. Like, you so for her to burn it, kind of make Yeah, like, it doesn't make sense. Sense, yeah. bro. Like it doesn't even make sense. Yeah. The war lasted maybe like a ten years in, in itself, like yeah. eight to ten. You know what I'm saying? Like, what are we doing? But you know, it's all G. I'm glad you That's got that right. off your chest. Yeah, we should we should do this guy from a long time ago. The we main, the main you know, character, he, did over he, the weekend. Killed, he killed Dan, uh, Daenerys Targaryen. That was like he was uh, screwing his auntie. Did um did old girl live? The did, one that everybody was rooting for was her name Cersei or something like that. Nobody was rooting for her. I guarantee oh. you that one. I, I guess the one that was, was like killing was, everybody and shit. Bro, I'm going to tell you how sick this lady is on the show. People are upset that she died, kind of went out kind of easy. You know what I'm saying? Like, for real. Wow. It didn't go as gory <laughs> like, as they wanted it. Like, she, the castle fell down on her. You know, that type. Oh, I like, did see that meme. It was like, like, her under the it was like oh, no, nah, she went out too easy. Like, how she died like that? You know what I'm saying? Like. Like what y'all want? The Colombian necktie around this? Basically. <laughs> like everybody like upset. Like, oh, yeah. she went out too easy. Like she got off easy. Mm. That's funny. You know, I'm you know, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, man, you get it off your chest, bro. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Tell me you're sorry. No, nah, I'm saying that. It hurt me, bro. Like, yeah. I've been, I've been, yeah. <laughs> no, but see, look, check this out, though, right? Like, we had a round why, table. Why, did, why did your voice crack? It hurt me, it, bro. It hurt me, bro. Like, it, hurt it didn't me, hurt bro. just you, though. It's like, I'm talking uh, about everything I read, it's the same. Like, everybody say the same thing. Uh, Where who, who is, um, wait, hold on. Let me look. Let me look at my memes again so I can figure out who. I'm nah, it hurt me, dog. It hurt me, dog. Like, it so, I think they probably just. 
They probably took uh, that one episode, the 55 day. That shit just probably just took so much energy. They like, man. I'm glad doing? you said that because I was just about to say that everybody is just probably just sick and tired, bro. Yeah. When you think about it. Yeah, but it ain't about you at that point. Yes, it is. One of, <laughs> one of my girls, like I told you a few weeks ago, she had a sex scene, but like you remember her oh, when she yeah. was 12. Like, you like, oh, oh yeah, shit, yeah, what's going yeah. on? You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? One of the other kids, like, oh, she got some nice little titties on us. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> this is what men think real. But, but, but this <laughs> game, like, oh, oh, what's going on, bro? You feel like, uh, yeah, Jared from Subway. Oh, bro. I'm done, bro. <laughs> Mad gross. <laughs> I'm done, bro. Somebody <laughs> come confiscate your computer. I'm done. <laughs> Ain't no telling what you got on there. I'm done, bro. Ooh, but bro. to your point, black. But to your point, <laughs> to your point, Black, they just probably just tired. Like, even the one the main character, he was like, I'm glad it's over with. You know what I'm saying? Because you can't, how they shooting, like, I know the 55 was a little extreme. That's not the norm, yeah, per yeah, se, yeah. but you really got to prepare for that. Right. And that's like a year's process. You got to read them scripts, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Then you got the filming Until process. Prepare, yeah. You know what I'm saying? All kind of stuff. You know what You I'm say saying? what? This been, what, 10 years in the making? About 10 years. So I think. they ain't really been able to do another I want to say they started in like 2000. I was going to say it was probably longer for like them that. because if it was 10 years of y'all watching it, it's probably been 12 or 14 yeah. for them yeah, because yeah, yeah, it true. takes true. them a while to pick it up to and get scripted. and For them to get cast. Yeah, and all that, yeah. That's true. So That's who is who is Night King? Somebody, the world star posted. I wish Night King would have just killed everybody. Facts of life. So uh, <laughs> he, he was all right. I got he that. He was sort of like Cheyenne in tune. That was he sort of like tune. the main antagonist. Uh, even though you know you never hear this nigga speak or anything like that. It's kind of like the main antagonist. You know what I mean? That he was basically deaf. You know what I mean? So. They was gearing up to fight him. They defeated him or whatever on some fluke shit. But it, you know it's all good. Mm-hmm. But because it's pretty, it's plenty of tagging. It's like the, Cersei, the girl, okay. the lady you was talking about. She's an antagonist the whole time. Like, no, this is bitch is pure oh, okay. evil. Okay, never mind. But, you know, I'll ask you later because I don't know if this is the same person. So, so okay, I kind of feel for you, bro. Like I can see it in you that you were disappointed. I was, bro, and I don't expect every show to end perfectly, bro. It don't really happen. But like it didn't that. have to end like that. It didn't have to end like that. Mm. You don't give me back like that. And, mm. and, and I'm going to put this out there for this last thing I'm going to say. Yeah. The writer, like not of the show, but of the books, mm. who they got the material, the source material off, he's lazy as shit, bro. He had years to finish this last book. Well, he did say he was going to follow the script of. He's lazy, of bro. The, of the show. To, like, ben had, you had years to prepare for this. Like, you're a writer. Yeah. yeah. I can understand you got a writer's block for a few months. You know Maybe I mean? he didn't care either. Take the year off or whatever, bro. You had you years right. to prepare for this. To prepare for this, you know what I mean. So like, and he's not finished yet, like with the last book. So they really were going off script, like just making this shit up as they as they go. The wow. the writers of the show, mm-hmm. and that might not that's not their expertise because it's not their vision. It's not that right. Right, 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 right. That's why I also think that was kind of weird because he's like, he's coming out with books after the season has ended, and it's like, is he gonna like? Well, I know what he said he's gonna do, but it's like. Nobody's going to read the book anymore because the season ended so terrible. What I'm saying, like, you created this whole world. What's my man name that created Star Wars? George Lucas. George Lucas got this world, but he don't finish the he, – he write the books. He don't make this whole world. He don't finish the last book. Now you're expecting somebody else to do that. Right. You know, I'm done. <laughs> so. Hey, so we – um. I'm hot. We got we to gotta, we gotta wrap up just a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Um. <laughs> 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 Nigga pissed. You gotta end it better than Game of Thrones. Yeah. Hey, bro, where are they they at? Who On Boulevard. At? He got a family to feed. <laughs> 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 got a family to feed. Yo, you are stu- that was a good one. That was good. That man. was a good one. That was good. That was good. He it had some records on. though. That thing came yeah. like some records, bro. I really 2015, like 2016. He has some records. He has a record. That was what? what how, how long ago? 2015, yeah. 2016. Bro, niggas will fall off like wet dope in a minute, bro. No, I'm wet. saying. I hope he's still working, though. You know I, looked that, on that his, I looked on his IG page as of May 3rd. He's still posting. But in his um, IG post, he got, you know, um, it said spend it. And spend that shit. Hey, yeah. that was my shit too. So it was kind of like, you know, he's still, he probably still hitting the road with them. Oh, he's still. Yeah, he had the clubs with it, you know. Catching a 10. For sure. 
sure. Probably no, not now. Five yeah, he probably. Ain't nothing wrong with that, bro. It probably ain't even. It probably ain't five. Hey, it probably ain't no five. Probably ain't no five. Hey, that chitless circuit to catch though. that five. Listen, yeah, 20 bro. minutes? Hey, if even. It probably ain't no five, though. Not now, bro. Like, the record came in. <laughs> you probably. 500? No, 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 no. <laughs> if price get getting lower. There's no way you going, bro. In the bottle? He, he probably know you know something. He got a mm. Barnesville, Georgia. No, no, bro. No. Whoa. <laughs> Real talk. He got a Whoa. Barnesville. He probably catching the For nine. sure. Maybe a stack. You know what I mean? No, he probably, Bottle again, like, I, I'll say anywhere well. between two to five. Like, being realistic. A, a show? Thousand. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. He's still getting. No. Because like, he had, like, certified, I know like, that, but I meant, like, a thousand. Well, hold on. Those went hit, like. What, I mean, it? he was performing at BET and everything, dog. I'm saying, but those went, like, Billboard hit records. So, but he still ain't. wasn't. Not billboard, shit. but I'll talk about like R and B club. Like he's still getting the bag, bro. Bro, check it. That went on the charts, bro. Not in the top one hundred. I seriously doubt it. You can look it up, tell me. I mean, I ain't, you know. My, I'll I'll check it out. I'll check it out. Fast I'll right do now. it while y'all doing y'all thing. I'll come back with oh, you. Oh, uh, uh, mm. fabulous. Mm -hmm. So, uh, my word, my word of the week is remittance. Remittance. So. <laughs> <laughs> No, so this is not, this isn't the same oh, one that was like earlier, is it? Spelled R E M I T T A N C E, and its definition is transmittal of money. Mm. I'll come with a uh, sentence later on. Um, if y'all do want to know, I can tell you real quick what you mean. Peaked at number sixty-six on um, the U.S. top um, charts. Or in rap charts, it peaked at 14, but Spend It and the Spend It Remix did not chart at all. That's, that's tough. But it did. I mean, it did what it, it – I'm talking – this is like Billboard. Billboard. Radio, it it's did very high well high on the radio. Day. Like, I mean, that song played all the time. But, yeah, he probably still picking up at least at least two. I hope so. Like, yeah. It, it, it'd be a shame how – if he, in, yeah. if he in the chip circuit, bro, he still can hey, pick it up. Some people's fast. careers be, your life comes at you fast. Yeah. Your careers be, you know what I'm saying? Like, you be on the top of the world, you think, well, this is it. But the cool thing about it is, like, um, what's his name? Chameleonaire? Like, even if you don't, or even spectacular, like, you could be up there and then Niggas ain't go thinking sit down like that. somewhere and go do some other shit. Niggas ain't thinking like that. That's what I'm saying. That, those are very rare and special people know, to do that. I know. Most I people know. think that bag going to keep coming, and then don't. next thing you know, Three years, of, like, Spinning came out in 2015, 2016, bro. Mm -hmm. Three years ago. That three years flew by, though. Like, three years. It don't even yeah. feel like that, bro. Like, three uh, years don't went by. 2016, Well, I think Spinning was the... Summer, summer that was, like, his last nah. hit. But what he had? He had another one, though. The Family, the, the, the uh... Eight. Eight. Oh, that was, the, yeah, that was the big... That was actually the bigger yeah. chart. That was last... I know that was 15. That was yeah. the summer of 15. That was okay, the big... So that was the one that... That, that put him up, yeah. That went. Yeah, and Spin it was the one that, you know... Ago. Yeah, so that's 2015, yeah, that's bro. God. so fast. Wow. I'm, I'm, you know... Damn, that is four years. No, we, so I know we running on time, but I'm, you know, even like somebody like Lucci, like, he, he hit it hard. You know what? I was just thinking that. I'm like, he kind of, like, Rich Homie fell off real... They hit it hard. Yeah, they I'm hit it hard. Yeah. But if they business wasn't right then, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, that's, I know Rich Homie business wasn't right, you know what I'm saying? Like, like... Yeah. That's a tough man. Like hip hop is a tough game, bro. Scam too. Shit that's a like tough game. Years, man. If you if you somebody that's chasing that that yeah, like you got plenty Longevity. of people still tour yeah. all day long. But mm -hmm. if you chasing that that fame and you get a little piece of that, it's and you can't years. keep reproducing that, yeah, I think Lucci hit it pretty hard. But at the end of the day, like I ain't heard nothing I like from him since like the second mixtape. No. I mean, in the words of um, Saha the Prince, mm. they're weekend artists, meaning that their music they perform at the clubs on the weekend, and basically don't you don't have to be there. Like people go into the club regardless if you show up or not. Right. So you go in, you come into the club like when somebody come, that's a bonus. Oh, oh, no, say that for Lucci though. Mm. Lucci, nah, he, yeah, he he, 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 he hit it hard. He hit it pretty hard, bro. And even the, the song he had with P and B Rock, like that, that was his only radio like that's club the, song for that I can think of. That uh, Lucci, I think he just came uh, up with some. Cause this wish me well. well. I, I, I'm thinking about what's going on in the city too. Like yeah, that one he had with Schoolie. That one he had with Schoolie was like you know that, that hit the hood. Nah, it wasn't worldwide. But I'm talking about nah. that mixtape. His mixtape was like 
That was fire. But not, no disrespect to Sidell, but what is he? Um, he well, he he said that he is a a touring act, meaning that he performs Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. No, I'm saying I understand what he's saying. Like he don't have the club records. He doesn't, but but he got he has like album material, meaning that you got to sell tickets. Going, yeah. So it's like even if he might like, for example, he might be at a venue that only holds 500 people, but those are 500 people that went paid his fans. Ticket. Those yeah. are his fans. Yeah. You know, right, he got right. A, he got a gen, like a he'll be at, he'll be at something like yeah. that. But J Rock J Rock got worldwide hits right now though. He do. What, that was early. He no, he got two. Now nah, three. When Kings did. Oh, that's Kane's there, and uh, he got two strong it's, it's, hits. It's, a, it's another one I can't think of right now. Now that, that might be it. Yeah, that might be it. He got, I mean, he got good records, but those are two like bona fide. Yeah, yeah, those two. Those are hits. I don't know that that Western was picking up some traction too. The the, the freestyle, the wild freestyle. Yeah, it picked up a little bit. It didn't. Man, it ain't. Out of sight, out of mind with J Cole. That's like the other. I can't think of it. That's King's Dead. No, 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 I ain't talking about. Dang, I can't think of. I, I can't think. I can hear it, but I can't. I can't see it. Yeah. I can't think of. It. We'll but I'm saying, that. yeah. But that's that's the thing, though. It was like your fans, regardless of the size, yeah. they spending money on your tickets. Yeah. That makes sense. Take us home, Oh, what's your uh, shout out mm, of the week? My song, my shout out of the week. It's very special and very like near and dear to my heart. Uh oh. <laughs> that means she um, went out this weekend. <laughs> Shut up. No, it's not. So my shout out of the week goes to none other than myself and Miss Shadow Rose. We are putting together an event called Books and Booze. Um, okay. for those that don't know, she has just what created booze? Boo- books, books and booze, boobs, booze, booze like Alcohol. liquor. Yeah. Okay. So she just created a self-publishing workbook, um, which she'll be kind of going through the twelve steps of how to self-publish your, your work of art via that. Be like. Oh, sorry. Um, <laughs> she forgot about it. I did. Um, yeah, so whatever you're trying to create, um, via be a novel, a poetry book, biography, autobiography, she's got the 12 steps to, to get you self-published, um, and she'll That's be dope. demonstrating that through her class from 12 to 2. What's and the then date? Um, July 14th. July 14th. I was going to say right. And then from 2 to 4 is a networking mixer. We'll be doing a raffle. Um, we'll be doing a book swap, and then we'll be drinking and having a good time. So... The event is called Books and Booze. Um, you can go ahead and purchase the tickets. It's on Eventbrite. It's from 12 to 4. Um, it's at Cupcakery in East Point. It's July 14, 2009. Um, 2019. The fuck year am I in? And um, <laughs> Like that passed. Right, right. right. I'm, I'm ahead of my time. So, um, yeah, just make sure y'all go hit the link in my bio. Um, get Grab your tickets now. And um, that's pretty much it. That's, that's all I got for my shout out of the week. Shout out to you, boo. Just shot a rose in me, yeah. and that's it. Um, so thank y'all for tuning in to another episode of the No Buffer Podcast. We hope y'all enjoyed our new um, set design. Yeah, let us know. A collective event. Let us know. We're going to post a questionnaire on, on our page. Y'all can do a little poll and all that, all that jazz. But thank y'all for tuning in. Another episode of No Buffer Podcast. Check us out every Monday live from um, livehiphopdaily.tv. Last name good. Cheyenne X on um, Lingo Steve in the building, 7 p.m. And we will see y'all next week. Yeah.